Welcome to KSR Data Vision YouTube channel. In this video, we'll see the difference between today function and now function. So these are the two functions which always creates a confusion when you have to use and what is the reason behind this function usage. So that is something which we'll be seeing as part of this video. So both fall under the time and date functions which has been categorized in time and date uh, date functions now let's go and write two measures the one i'll write it as measure as so this measure i will write it as today today and the function i have in the tag function is also called today so i'll just stay today date i'll just give the name for this and i'll write the function today now again i'll go and write a new measure so this time i'll write now now and i'll use a function called now okay now i've written today as well as i've written now let's go and see what exactly this function does to make it simple i'll put it in a card i'll put it in a card and i'll take one more card for one of the card i will drag today's date and for one of the card let me drag now what is the difference what is the difference in today's date i can see there is a time which is zero and the date information is given it is saying as january 1st 2022 now the second function which i have written as a now function what it is showing it is showing the 11th jan along with that it is also showing the time let's say just the time is 11 22 that 11 22 time has been captured what is the difference today will be concentrating on the date only but as a now function will also be concentrating on the date as well as the timestamp now when you talk about the usage application when you have to use what let's say there is any birth date information or a joining date information you can just go with a today function because when someone is asking you what is your birthday you say maybe january 1st 2020 2000 or maybe january 3rd 1995 this is what you say you never say that i was born at 6 30 8 30 9 30 you never say that in that type of situations you can just go with the function called today now coming to the now function every minute the business is running every minute the transactions is happening let's say amazon flipkart mintra or even a share market every second the transaction is going to change in this type of use cases and the business the time is also very important let's say in the last five minutes how much revenue you generated in the last 15 minutes how much time how much revenue you generated in this type of situations the now function will be a major impact because this is giving along with the date it is also giving the time information so remember when you have to use today function and when you have to use now function and in fact you can just go and change a format as well what format you want whether you want in this format this format this format you can select all the built-in formats that the result has been given no, no, I've just selected the time which does not give me any date information. The same thing if I go and do it in the now function with just the time, it will give me the current time. So this is how you can change according to your data type. But remember, if this is also an interview question. Nowadays, they are started asking Anna as a real time use case they ask when you'll go with today function when you'll go with now function what is the use how it is differentiated how it is calculated so this is all something which is expected and also this will be useful for your real-time scenarios thanks for watching again we'll come back with a new topic